Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Jedi. Today we're going to look at the top 10 facts about marijuana that you probably never knew, so let's get into it. <laughs> That it slows and stops the spread of cancer cells so cancer cells all over your body if you did have them when you take marijuana that does help break it apart and kind of like spread it so it doesn't like completely cure cancer or anything like that but it, it helps it helps the spread because it kind of controls it so marijuana is like a marijuana is like a really good addition if you want to like stop from getting you know if you want to help yourself take that next preventive step from you know helping from your it's like a help so it's like how it's like you helping your body to stop the spread of cancer cancer cells. Number two that it is that it prevents Alzheimer's. So since marijuana does have THC, which does um, well, THC has THC has some particles that does help prevent Alzheimer's. So then the whole memory loss thing, um, it it kind of helps with your memory. So um, Alzheimer's is like very unlikely to hit people who already you know who regularly use cannabis because of its THC. So, so you know, uh, so another really way to treat Alzheimer's is to always take some more THC. Number three is relief in arteritis. In arteritis. So, if you take um, marijuana, or if you, if you take a tablet, which is what most, most of the physicists gave to their patients who had arthritis, it's called Sativex. So when you, when you take that tablet, it really, it's, it's like marijuana based. So then it completely, um, a, a lot of the, physicist said that it really helped their patients with healing joints and also helping recover so that's another really good medicine to relieve arthritis the next one is to do is that it decreases an anxiety so when people have anxiety and when they're feeling really low and it's they're in a bad mental state of course we know that marijuana really helps your mental state and this way um its chemicals actually help soothe the brain and really relax yourself so then a lot of the anxiety that you build up is usually lost when when you take marijuana next one something that i'm sure you guys did not know so taking marijuana actually helps reverse the effects of tobacco so if someone was smoking cigarettes and they moved to marijuana that would actually help reverse this, the effects of tobacco and marijuana helps lung health so of course um there are some side effects to it too like no matter no matter uh what you take if you're burning something you're definitely gonna have that combustion so that is definitely gonna hurt your lungs but there's other ways to take marijuana. You don't you don't just have to um, use fire and actually smoke marijuana. You could there there's there's other way to take it too, and it really helps with lung health. Marijuana helps protect the brain from a stroke. So if someone's recovering from a stroke, marijuana really helps protect them, so then they don't get another stroke. And since when you get a stroke, your brain is like half not like if let's just say somebody gets a stroke in their left side, so then your left your 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 left side of the brain would like be really damaged. So when you take marijuana, marijuana really helps soothe. So marijuana is like a chemical that really breaks and soothes um, the elements that it's hitting. This one I'm sure you guys all knew, but it does help with P PTSD. So uh, veterans returning from war, when um, they they take marijuana, it really helps soothe. So it's really relaxing. And a lot of the people who take it say that um, they like it really helps because it, help, it helps you soothe and then they don't uh, remember most of the stuff from war which usually like so a lot of people say that they can't sleep because of the things that they remember from war so when you take marijuana it really helps that and marijuana could also be used as like a form of um, melatonin so when you can't sleep you take marijuana and you, you usually fall asleep pretty quick marijuana can be used in different forms to control muscle spasms and other muscle pains so you could take marijuana and just inhaling it would would help you um, kind of like lose overall pain, but you could you could also get like a rolling bomb that they that they sell in like most of the pharmacies. It's like OTC, so you you, you could get that which does not have THC THC and you could just use that, and it completely relieves the pain. Um, and you can just rub it on the parts where you feel pain. So a lot of athletes actually recommend using this, and they do use it in their training because they say that it's really helpful and it does relieve more pain. So going back to the sleep thing, um, marijuana is proven to eliminate nightmares. So once you take marijuana, um, if you're having trouble sleeping and if you don't wanna, and, and if you're afraid to sleep because of nightmares, marijuana completely eliminates that because um, nightmares are usually induced when you don't have like REM sleep, which is rapid eye movement sleep. That's when you dream. And so marijuana basically like soothes your brain. So you get good dreams and your REM is completely affected. 
So when you sleep, you sleep more peacefully and like, and you also have longevity when you sleep. And the last one is also another brain fact. So it does help you with concussion and trauma. So trauma, of course, marijuana is a soothing drug. So of course it's going to help with trauma, but concussion. So even though that's a physical thing, when you take marijuana, um, since it, since it does affect your brain, it does, um, protect your brain from concussions. So the whole idea of concussion is when you get hit really hard in your head, so your brain starts to move. But when when you have marijuana, your brain kind of soothes down and it just uh, doesn't move. So it does prevent concussions too. All right, guys, that's it for today. Today's a pretty short video. Um, hope you guys learned a lot of new facts about marijuana. Please leave please leave some of the facts that you want to know about in the comment section below. If you knew any facts that about marijuana that I did not cover in this video, leave that down too. Make sure you guys like the video, share the video, and subscribe. Yeah, make sure you guys do that, and also follow me on Instagram. Make sure you guys like the video. Thank you.